The objective of this video is to understand what is the difference between command line interface that is called CLI or graphic user interface that is called GUI. And then we are going to see what is the importance of CLI means what is the importance of command line interface over the graphic user interface. So let's begin with the objective now. Let's see the difference between GUI and CLI. Now we are in the folder command line interface. Now with the help of GUI or graphic user interface, we are going to create a folder with the name file one. So right click here, click on new and select folder. We name it file one. So this is the directory of folder which is created with the help of GUI. Now we are going to create file two directory with the help of CLI. So we are going to open PowerShell. Don't worry about the PowerShell. Why we are using PowerShell, we are going to discuss in a few minutes. So as with the definition, we have said that CLI will take some text input to make or perform some operating system functions. So we are going to write some inputs or text inputs here. So we are going to write make mkdir directory and give the file name file2 and as we hit the enter, we are going to see file2 is created here in the folder command line interface. Why it is created here only because as you can see that here also we have a path called command line interface. Don't worry what is path we are going to discuss in a few minutes. This is a small message that we are not going to study about path or the commands of command line interface in this video. If you want to study about the path then you can watch this video that is called root directory, home directory, absolute path. The link for this video is given in the description. If you want to study about the commands of command line interface, then you can watch this video that is called basic commands of command line interface and the link for this video is also given in the description. So this was the message. Let's get back to the study now. Right now we are going to enter make directory file to and a file to directory is created here will be created here. Okay, hit enter. Now as you see here also CLI is given some kind of reply also that this file is created here and the timestamp is given and the date is also given and the file 2 is created in the command line interface with the help of CLI. Now you must be thinking that why we are studying about CLI because graphic user interface is performing the same way as the command line interface and graphic user interface is a easy way to perform the operating system functions. The question arises is that that why we are studying about CLI because similar tasks is performed by GUI very easily. So the first point is that CLI requires less resources means for GUI you require a mouse also with your system. But for CLI you don't need a mouse you need a keyboard and you can interact with the system very easily and perform similar tasks with minimum resources. So this was the first point it requires less resource. The second point is that it ensures high precision means you can perform some specific command to a specific destination very easily. So this was the second point. The third point is that CLI is very helpful in performing repetitive tasks. Suppose you have a folder and it contains 1000 files. Now you have to perform similar tasks on those 1000 files. So with the help of CLI you have to write one command and that command will be executed on all the 1000 files automatically so repetitive tasks becomes very easy so this was the third point it is helpful in performing repetitive tasks the fourth point is that cli is very very powerful today's operating systems like windows and mac os they comes with the security so that you don't mess up with your system core process and gui is not allowed to reach those core processes but with the help of CLI the whole system is in your hand or you have the full control over your system with CLI so that's why CLI is very very powerful so these were the points that CLI needs fewer resources it ensures high precision it handles repetitive tasks easily and it is very very powerful if you have any doubt regarding this topic write down in the comment section and if you think that this video was good, then do share the videos to others and subscribe the channel for new videos like this. And if you think that there are other topics on which the videos to be made, then write that topic in the comment section. 
थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो